Buying or renting a home is a lifelong and major decision that you have to be sure if it is right for you. Thinking of which can be difficult to answer because there is no right answer to whether you should buy or rent as it all depends on what is going on in the individual life. There are benefits and drawbacks to both sides of the coin. Yes, the final decision lies in your hand. One is cheaper than the other and I believe you will take the bet that renting is way cheaper than buying a home but that is not always the defining factor because one's decision can be pinned down to lifestyle consideration such as whether you want flexibility or stability so if you are still wondering whether you should buy or rent then watch this video till the very end because I am going to share some hidden secrets on how to know which is best at a given stage in your life. My name is Omotayo Patrick. I am a real estate entrepreneur. In this video, I am going to dive in depth into the objective benefits and drawbacks to buying and renting a house that will occur in most cases. Because aside from the personal circumstances, some benefits and drawbacks can affect the reason for buying and renting a house. Here are the benefits and drawbacks of renting a house which will be an eye opener for you to make the right decision for yourself. Firstly, I go with the benefits of renting a house. Number one, it allows you to try different environments. Number two, it is way cheaper. Number three, the landlord pays for maintenance and repairs. Number four, it gives you flexibility and freedom to change. Secondly, the drawbacks of renting a house. Number one, the landlord might sell or decide to stop renting at any time. Number two, the rent could go up over time. Number three, you have limited ability to customize your living space. Number four, you don't build any equity over time. Number five, you have a limited sense of home stability. Comes to buying a home. Here are the benefits and drawbacks of buying a home. Firstly, the benefits of buying a home. Number one, you have the freedom to customize your living space. Number two, you build equity over time. Then number three, the home value may increase over time. Number four, it gives the sense of home stability. Secondly, the drawbacks of buying a home number one the closing cost can be so expensive number two you own the responsibility for maintenance and repairs number three you have limited flexibility to move because it will cost you more number four the home value may decrease with time please here is where i ask you to like this video in order to get it to as many people as possible thank you so this is the right question you have to ask yourself when making your decision on renting or buying a house number one flexibility or stability which one is more important to you at this point in your life number two what does your net worth tell you number three what cost makes sense to you right now number four have you weighed the risk of renting and buying so my honest opinions on this is there are no right or wrong answers to whether you buy or rent as whatever is your answer right now might change over time also your answer might be based on what is going on in your life at that particular time for example when you just get married and you want to start a new life with your spouse that new job at a crucial moment might be the determinant or sometimes job obligations like when you are transferred to another state or country for a long time which might just have a hint in your decision or you are retiring from your job and many more you can think of at a given time in my scenario i have always wanted to have my own home as that has been an african thing especially in nigeria 
But my finances at the time have been hindering my decision. And I decided to continue renting until I was earning enough to own a home. As an African heritage, having your own home is paramount to show you have made it in life. But it is not always right to make a decision in order to prove yourself to others. We have to be well informed about what is at stake here. And that is why I decided to share this video with you guys. So you can have one or two ideas to help you make the right decision. So you are not in this alone.